Because the sun fancied me more, my chances became slim like crackheads and cigarettes, inhaling secondhand chances like a second class citizen inheriting cancer for self confidence whose love became dark on all of her skin, cocoa color. Some say the black and the berry, the sweet of the juice, but why does this nectar taste so sour? I am the field it. Whose spine has been curved for so long to obtain the same opportunities the house slave obtained at the cost. The like nigga. Representing too much wrong when the mass is like a glass and I am other than the dirt on the bottom of a shoe. And this is what it's like 300 years later. Because at the darkest the color of palm skin is now a sin. We feel back to the bleaching dream and dive in. Like Olympic champions and hopes becoming gold. I mean yellow. I wear these women leaves in great contacts and know what it feels like to be mixed mulatto. Now why does I have such a room to it? My mother always told me I only had to do two things. Stay black and die, but after 19 plus years, black becomes boring. I wouldn't be able to list my heritage like pros and cons, but I'm constantly repeating frequently asked questions I refuse. To pay some white organization hundreds of dollars to retrace my ancestors' steps is if I lost something. Because I can retrace my own steps. Backtrack this perm and bleach these spots and put my room on lock like six shit. But I just learned how to drive so I back up slow, catching the wind's wrath and my afro, and I'm still generic. Why you're a clean neck, I'm just rough around the edges. Why am I to blame when my skin can't obtain your noticeable tan? Damn. Why do scientific tests show that black children prefer white gals instead of black ones? This is a thing. For all my sisters with that curved spine and kinky hair, this is an anthem. For all my sisters whose life and skin tone is unfair, this is an anthem. Because plums can also be sweeter than apricots. Mm. Girl.